Wait. Wow. My dad. Nice. Ooh, the cancel out. Am I gonna get hit? Yeah. You should use V-Skill too. Gary Lewis, that's a good point as well. That's another way you can open them up. If they're playing defensive, they're running away. You can use V-Skill 2, throw the ferret out at them. And that, again, puts some pressure on them, forces them to do something or deal with the ferret. They block it, you build some V-Gage. But I'm using Gil as my main. But if you're using Gil, you can use the light, uh, the ice fireball and follow behind the ice fireball for some pressure. Get the chip. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Follow behind the ice fireball if they allow you to get it out. You get some pressure there. Get some grey elf, get some chip on them. You win. For defensive players, is it, a vi is it viable to get a life lead then go full lane? You could do that. You could go lane before the life lead. See if they crack at any moment. If you've got the life lead, then you're forcing them to do something. Then you can get information from them about how they, they want to go about opening you up. I get to keep the oh no You gotta give Snafkin that, that was beautiful. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Stone Cold Mode Daigo's Pupil. <laughs> I've gotten past my salt in this game when I lose, but Infectious is just so chill. On another level, win or lose. You gotta um, show appreciation when they do something sick. Yeah, don't use it. Nice. Nice, I like the meter usage. Wait, doesn't he have... Oh no, he had V-Skill 1, so he couldn't quite, um, capitalize on that hit there. Oh, they commit. Nice. 
Nice. Didn't get the activate. <laughs> that was a cancel. <laughs> he was dead to the chip. Born. So no, you can. Oh, it's a toll. What? Does Eku even really have bad matchups? Very few standout ones that are, are really hard, but he does have some tricky ones. The zoners can be tricky. Ooh. Fight me. Nice, nice. Cancel out. Am I going to get hit? Yeah. That's a bit mad. You, so you mentioned dropping inputs at crucial moments. So that, that sounds like muscle memory and combos. So you might have to be doing combo drills in training mode before you go and start your matches. When you say crucial moments, are you talking about punishing moves? So if you're dropping, dropping punishes, then that can be a sign that you've not... Oof. Nasty trade sign that you've not got those punishes into your muscle memory. The cancel out. It was no match for Ed's um I had the other V-trigger, so I should have... I should have done uh, V-skill 1 there on the double stand first. Infectious, my training is finally paying off. I improved my anti-air game so much by choosing to buffer after all of my normals. Thanks for the video's tips, boy. Sounds good. That's a good way to implement it as well. It's a um, constant switch from the sky to the ground, sky to the ground. Strike. Oh, I don't believe that, yeah. Oh, the whiff punish. Yeah, I get that, yeah. No! Oh, wrong button. Again, I wasn't. Too long. I'm surprised that worked.
Ah, a bit far out. UK it's August, but for Japan it's soon. Yeah, really soon. And Japan get four events as well, so they're spread all over the year. Infectious, do you think players should know all the frame data in order to become a professional? No, that's not possible. It's impossible to know all the frame data. Do you know how many different moves, characters, interactions? Like, you can't know everything. 